In August of last year, a Michigan man sued Olive Garden after alleging finding a rat foot in his minestrone soup. Just the foot? Olive Garden said, there's no way it's their rat foot because it didn't take on the soup color. Plus, it's bigger than their spoons. Great point from Olive Garden. If you got a body part in your food, make sure you leave it in there long enough for it to pick up the color. Otherwise, it's your rat foot now. Put it on a keychain. Maybe it's good luck. Oh, my God. That, that ran Ooh. on like it was the Q&A. Or the comment. Yeah, 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 it did. <laughs> tall pants oh rat foot. Tall, tall pants rat foot. Milkshake. <laughs> tall, tall pants rat foot. Oh Dude, God. Gracie should read Ooh. one of the... Oh, that's a good idea. Definitely. There are three, so that'll be good. That'll be good. Okay. You'll, you'll see. We have the a new segment in the fact. show. You'll love it, Gracie. Oh, fuck, okay. In 2017, <laughs> a Texas woman was eating a stuffed mushroom appetizer, <laughs> but it was too hot and burned her mouth, which caused her to swallow it, but it got lodged in the throat, causing her to choke and burn her throat. Oh, no. <laughs> then she spit it up and started to drive home. Then her throat started to close up as she was driving. So an ambulance, this is serious, I had to take her to the burn ward at the hospital. In response, Olive Garden removed the dish from the menu and started serving people rat feet. Now, wait just a second. That can't be right. Face palm, black and white emoji. Oh, brother. Oh, my Holy God. God. Oh, dude. <laughs> not, not to diminish what this lady went through, but... How many rigs could you be stepping on? <laughs> it just kept Stop. happening. Stop. 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 <laughs> when they came out, when they brought the, it's making they, me sweat and cry. When they brought, when they brought the, when they brought the food out, oh my God. when they brought the food out, they don't do it with every plate. Just no, some. No. The guy put it next to Eric, and he's like, "Be careful, it's the very plate, hot. The, it's the plate is hot. hot." I just went, "Touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it, lick it, lick it, lick it." Put it in your mouth. Me and Michael, lick it, lick it, lick it, lick it. Put the plate in your mouth. Eat it. When you were doing that, I thought. Oh, this last fact is going to be really good. <laughs> Imagine you know, it just uh, keeps happening. Take a bite. Ow! Hot. <laughs> <laughs> also, <laughs> also, I don't know if anyone else had flashbacks as you're reading this uh, of, oh, Nick, I, I of sure Nick did. getting spaghetti <laughs> caught in his throat. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, we sit down and tell He set this up. He, yeah, he set this up. Oh he he regales us a story <laughs> of the time he... <laughs> what we're talking about. It's been such a long time since I've been to Olive Garden. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. And then Nick goes, yeah, one time I almost died at an Olive Garden. And oh, the last time I was here, I almost died at an Olive Garden. And we're like, Pl please tell. And, and Okay, Nick, correct me if I'm wrong. Oh, my God. The situation was you were getting, like, endless soup, salad, and pasta? or Endless pasta. Endless pasta. And you were, uh, you and a friend. His and, friend was also getting the endless pasta. Right. And so immediately, for some reason, Nick thought it was a competition. And he had and he to was like, win dinner. He had to win the, the competition. Uh, go um, in, baby. So he starts hosing it down, gets on your second <laughs> yeah. plate of, I assume, spaghetti and meatballs. Uh -huh. um, and a noodle gets, <laughs> gets, works its way down there. The long way, uh -huh. <laughs> so long, in fact, that you start choking, and the only way you can get it out is to Pull it out. extract <laughs> it along. <laughs> and he's all he's telling the story, but he's like, I had to like discreetly do it. <laughs> but he's so, he shot but so he's doing right, it. Right. He's so then he goes, and he goes, uh, uh, yeah. uh, had to do it discreetly like this. Napkin, go, uh, 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 uh. In the fucking in the fucking Olive Garden. <laughs> so he tells us that story. Oh. Then, if you recall, back at the beginning of the episode, right. he almost, fucking ordered spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> almost in a like Chekhov's gun situation, where he set it up oh perfectly. Uh, <laughs> halfway through the meal, he just he starts choking. Gracie made some crack. Nick starts choking, and he, he's just like, "Not again!" <laughs> he's literally going, ah, 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 ah. "And I was, like, I was like, open your mouth, I'll, I'll pull it, I'll pull it." <laughs> Jordan, Jordan started trying to extract the spaghetti oh, noodle. I had already God. forgotten the finer points. I was like, "Dude, you gotta stop ordering spaghetti." He's like, "No, it was fettuccine last time." <laughs> And then I said, this would never happen with no G. <laughs> <laughs> they have it. They have that. They have that. Have that. <laughs> Gnocchi. There's Holy no G, sorry. Shit. This wouldn't happen with gnocchi. <laughs> <laughs>
I what? knew this was a good one. This one. I'm just glad we didn't. The, the next episode's gonna suck. I know. That's why I said it. Suck. I said it. We're gonna be. We're gonna be tired tomorrow. Oh, oh my God. God.